dishies, guess what? I have some mail. And you know, it is more dollhouse stuff. So if that's not your thing and you wanna see some dishes or some other hauls, I will link a different video for you to watch. But I don't know, I'm getting really into the dollhouse stuff. So yeah, I need to kind of calm myself down. I am really excited to see what's in here. Um, of course, I saw it when I had bid on the lot, but it's always so much more fun to see it in person, especially little tiny things. This is some furniture from the 1930s and it's marked Schoenhut. So I am really excited. And you can see I don't know if you can tell by the lighting, but it's all this lovely color. The book I'm using this time to set the furniture on is Home Primer, and it was a school book from the 1880s. And I just kind of tried to open it to the, to the best pages that would stay open. It's a sink. Oh, it's so wonderful. Schoenhut 1933. But I think that's just written on there. So, well, I love it. It certainly looks like a 1930s sink. Let me see if I can show it in a different way. Look at that. Isn't that wonderful? Let's see, it's about four inches across. Let's see what's next. Here's the next one. This looks like some kind of chair, maybe? These are very dusty and dirty, so I will just take a little paintbrush and brush them off. So two chairs, but they're made exactly like the other ones. So yeah, just taking a little paintbrush and sweeping it across the top will get a lot of that dirt off. Yes, some of the paint is worn off. What do you expect? And I will, of course, show you these when I figure out how I'm going to use them in my dollhouse. And this, more chairs. This one is pretty badly beaten up, but that's all right. One and a quarter inch across. About two and a half inches high. I'm sorry if my hands look a little worse for wear if there's paint and glue on them, but I have been crafting and creating some Halloween things for my dolls and my doll's house. Look at this adorable table. This is one of the things I really, really wanted. I have that big box I've been using for a table and it's just too big. And yeah, this furniture is amazing. This one has a little decal on it. I love that. I love the little decal. I love this. Okay. Oh, look at this. It's like a little sideboard. Oh, it's so cute. It's also got a little decal on it. it does open. Look at that. I can storage. You know, you have to Gonna have to be careful with that. Perfect. I am very, very happy with this purchase. And this, which I guess is um, an ice box. This also says Schoenhut 1933. I don't think the, yeah, that didn't say anything. But you can see they're all the same, right? Another little decal, so cute. And it's pretty nice inside. Looks like someone put a nail there to hold something together, but you can see how well it's made. 
It's beautiful and I I'm guessing this is an ice box. Tell me if I'm wrong. Tell me if I'm wrong. Well, there you go. Um, next stop, living room furniture and accessories. Well, I got two packages in the mail today. One I know is something I ordered on Ruby Lane. And of course it's doll, doll's house stuff. And the other one is from West Virginia, and I'm all these check contents. Oh, well, that might require me knowing what I ordered, which is not going to happen. It says, thank you. I ordered this from Carmen in Colorado. I like these little wooden boxes I got years ago. Oh, these are also little Strombecker chairs from the 1930s or 40s. What's, What's this? This is like a little, like a little dresser. Nice. These are little candles. So you could see how they would, oops. Oh, look how cute this is, okay. This is a little grater. How cute is that? And here's a little a little skillet and this is a little like a pasta pot with the strainer built in can you see the strainer there you can and these don't have any marking on them cute nice this is bigger than my other table that I opened I've already put that stuff away, so I'm not going to have it out to compare. Cute. I'm going to have to take some stuff off of here. Very nice. Very well made. It looks very similarly made to the other one. Yeah. Something else. This is a little dresser. Oh, like a... Or I guess it could be like a buffet. It's more a buffet, really, the way it's made. And my buffet looks just like that. It's got the drawers in the middle and the cupboards on the outside. This does not open or anything like that, but you can tell that it is vintage. This is a great lot. This is a big chair. You can see the scale difference there. But this will be nice to tuck in the corner. It's got a little cushion on it. Let's see. It's a gray, dreary day here today, so the light is terrible here in the parlor. Aha, here is a chair. Look at it. Oh, it's cool. I love it. So it kind of looks like, you know, worn leather would look. You know how it gets that crackly appearance a little bit, wrinkly, creased. I'm liking this. There's a lot more in here. Oh, look at this. This is, this is great. I am loving this. This is a cradle and this is a good, this is a big size. This is, this is four inches. Like I said, I'm not going to care too much about scale. 
right, let's see. I guess I better actually look in here. Books. Look. These are much bigger than the ones that I bought. These are nice. I'm going to need a bigger fireplace. <gasps> nice. And two table lamps. These are great. Now, I don't have any bedroom furniture, but I guess you could use it in the living room. Hmm? Maybe this could be, you know, a living room table. I don't remember this at all in the lot. It's a little clock. I'm just setting stuff up. I'm forgetting to show you. Look how cute. Better make sure I got everything. And I believe that is everything. All right, I'm very excited to open this and see what's in here. I don't know. Intriguing. I'm going to have to read the card. Okay, you are not going to believe this. This card is from a new subscriber and her name is Mary Jo V. I don't know if she'll want me to say her name and I'm gonna read you the sweet things she wrote. I hope she doesn't mind. Dear Dot Likes Red, I so enjoyed your recent videos showing your littles. Here are some miscellaneous pieces which came with a dollhouse my granddaughter, my granddaughters are no longer playing with. The dollhouse did not survive, but these are some of the better pieces that did. Oh my goodness, hope you like them. And look at this cute little card, this little Hummel card. Isn't that adorable? Mary Jo, I am really touched. Thank you so much. That is so sweet and kind of you to think of me. Oh my goodness. Well, I think Mary Jo, we might have to do a separate video because there are a lot of things in here. So come back and we'll open the rest of the mail.